In this video, I am going to demonstrate treating the reflex. Today's reflex is about rooting reflex. You see this reflex in the baby. When you scratch baby's face, the he turns neck the, towards the way of the scratching. You know, if I scratch this way, baby turns head this way to find their hood. You know, they are finding milk. They're, if there is a stimulus, they turn head this way. This reflex should be integrated as they grow up. But I am filming this video in March of 2021. You know what is happening right now, right? People, everybody wears mask. So there is a continuous stimulus around the face and mouth the continuous stimulus could evoke this reflex makes sense right that can be a pos possibility so if i scratch this person's uh, face he feels the itchiness you don't see the muscle contraction or obvious movement but he feels tinglingness or i feel he's the lip muscle kind of contracts as I scratch here. That is his reflex is appearing. Okay. Now I'd like to the integrate the reflex. If this reflex is retained, the people usually have to speak or mumbling. This reflex has something to do with speaking or chewing or maybe people have a sensitive mouth. Again, this is rooting reflex. You see this reflex among babies. Once again, I scratch mouse. I still feel the reaction right here. Once again, a little bit more. Good. I scratch mouth. Do you want to do? Oh, I don't feel any pain. What he says was he doesn't feel a uh, tickling or he doesn't feel itchiness here. That means his rooting reflex is integrated. Now maybe he doesn't feel something weirdness when he wears mask. You know, pe everybody wears mask as it, this is uh, 2021 March because of the continuous wearing mask. Maybe his reflex is now integrated. You know, uh, we are living in a hard time. Maybe the children have retained reflex. Maybe adults have retained reflex. So I hope this video helps your understanding of retained reflex and treatment for reflex. If you liked today's video, please like, comment, and subscribe. See you next video.